Thank you so much. Student Reporting Labs is a program of PBS NewsHour Extra. It connects high school students to local PBS stations to create investigative video reports. We have paired up with five different schools and after-school groups, and we'd like to share a report from Fraser High School. With cuts to performing arts in public schools, future musicians could be left without a place to hone their skills. People have been brought in who understand economics, but they don't understand the power of the arts. Music has always been associated with the sciences. From the medieval university, the quadrivium included music with arithmetic, astronomy, and geometry. Because not of its aesthetic value, but because of its mathematical structures. Not many students that I know are very interested in math or science. They're not very excited to go to that class. But people, on the other hand, are excited to go to classes like band or choir. Many Motown artists studied music education in Detroit public schools. What happens to the students when these programs are cut? The goal of a public school music program is not always necessarily churn out professional musicians. The same way that you need to be educated on how to balance a checkbook, you need to understand the effects that music can have on you. I mean, part of a music education is developing the artistic know-how to know what these forces are. Students who want to be economists and doctors are missing out on a crucial piece of their education as basic human beings. Jason Hartless reporting for PBS NewsHour, Student Reporting Labs.